Yo, what's going on, Sexy Samuel Let's go Today we're here doing a rank 1v1. I'm playing Bastet. Now, I've already recorded one game of Bastet. I don't know if it's going to go up or not. Because the ending of it was kind of anticlimactic. It was a little bit lame. Mm. Might edit these two together. I'd prefer not to edit today, actually, because uh, I'm pretty pressed on time, to be completely honest. So we'll see what happens. We'll see what happens. How do you like that? I am fighting a GM player. No, no, no. And he is playing set. All right. He'll out clear me, right? It's a safe route. This is weird. Okay, he does have his teleport. I was waiting to see if he's got that teleport up. So the reason I went Mage's Blessing is... <clears throat> Whoa. <laughs> the reason I went Mage's Blessing... Was because <clears throat> the mana usage that Bastet has is incredibly high. You actually don't win these, dude. He does have ult, actually. I don't know why he would try to hit me with that. Ooh. Gotta go beat stick, bro ham. I just want to stop his back. I don't even care, dude. How do you like that? How do you like that? All right. I've got my eye on you. Hmm. Will he fight me? He does want to fight. Hmm. I'm actually going to take this as a win. Because I can clear pretty quick with this. Nice. Nice. So I didn't get the kill, but I did get him off of me and was able to get the red buff because of it. Alright, cool. Um, actually, because of his HP, I think I want to do his blue buff too. He could definitely ult me and just kill the fuck out of me by now. By the way. I'm very surprised he hasn't. I didn't want to pick up red, by the way, because I I don't think that I'm going for a kill anytime soon unless he really messes up. I have not backed yet, so I'm very susceptible to getting butt fucked. Hmm. Close. Damn, I actually fucked him up. You're in no position to fight, my man. I'm like, do I go boots here? Or do I just go full on fucking transcendence? <sighs> I haven't backed yet. I have 3k gold. 
Lord Almighty. All right. I did actually hit him there and pushed him all the way back to his Phoenix. I'm chilling. Let's just get this. Get tier two boots. Get some pots. And actually get, get our asses back out there. My God. My God, man. I just backed with 3k gold. Normally, you're like... You're risking it if you want to stay for the first red buff. But I got the first red buff and then almost stayed for the second red buff. <laughs> Talk about sustain, my man. Holy shit. You're really fighting without your 3-up? Like, actually? What the fuck was that? Who does that? This man's in GM. He just tried to fight me as Set without his 3-up. It's the number one rule of Set. Don't fight if you don't have your 3. Oh, I'm dead. Damn, I died to I died to him. I really thought I died to tower there. I get a biscuit. Homemade, by the way. Well, I did that there. <laughs> hmm. I actually want a red buff this time. I think with a finished transcendence. I'm not scared of my mana going out. I picked up blue. God damn it, you stupid fuck. How can one person hold this much stupid in their brain? Holy fuck. They'll never know what hit him. I didn't even need to use abilities. I don't know why I ulted. Well, I ulted because I thought I needed to, but then it just turns out I didn't need to at all. Go breastplate. Obviously, I don't want to deal with that shit. Curse Stonk, so when he dives me, I can just onk his bitch ass, and once I get my uh, my beat stick, we'll be good. We'll have bitches and beat sticks on our build. Uh, I did. I am stacking, so I would like these last hits. How do you like that? Uh, uh, uh. Nice. Where you at? Doing Bull Demon, probably. That's what a good set would be doing right now. I don't hear him. Oh yeah, I do. He's way back there. Alright, we both got tier 2 defense. Oh, hi, dude. Holy. I definitely won that trade. Well, actually, it's pretty even. I actually want him to all in me here. Oh, damn. So close, man. So close. Red buff should be up soon. Very soon. We got his shell and his Aegis. That's pretty good. How do you like that? Oh, not jumping back, and you don't scare me. His three is out, which means I'm down to fight him. Yeah, he should be pretty upset, to be honest. How do you like that? 
I just outran the fuck out of him there. I am Bastet, and I do get movement speed when I use my one. Uh, 25% faster. So, that's pretty phantasmo. Um, I'm gonna die if I can't jump back. Okay, whatever, you can have it. I'm not dying for that. Big damage. I have ult up. Oh, they hit the minion. I knew it was going to teleport there, but I really thought that I would be able to root him with my 3 there. A little unfortunate, but also it's whatever, you know? It's whatever. I can get a uh, breastplate whenever I back. Alright. The breastplate, and then I'm gonna go beat stick, like I said. Um, I could upgrade my cursed onk. It would be pretty good immediately. But I don't know if I'm willing to sacrifice that 500 gold at the moment. I'd much rather save to finish beat stick and then upgrade my onk. Bull demon? No bull demon. It really doesn't do any fucking damage, does it? Oh, he could teleport an ult and I would just straight up die. Straight up doy. I got my jump back up, we're chilling. Alright. There it is. Alright, his 3 is over, which means he's no longer scary. But because of his breastplate, he got it back really quick. Hmm. Hmm, this is gonna be a very back and forth game, huh? I'm dead here. Big root. Uh, it's just a scratch. How do you like that? How do you like that? See you later, pumpkin. I knew he was gonna try to go for the kill, dude. It just seems like... He just seems like a greedy player, you know? I guess my play was greedy, right? Not his. My my play was the greedy play to go in and try to get the, the outplay. But when, I, when he teleported into Phoenix, I was like, all I have to do in order to live is juke the one a single time. Which is so easy as fast that, because I, I just jump, right? So... I was pretty certain we were okay. Rest in peace, all those minions. God, it was a fat fucking wave. My blue buff. Oh, god damn you, bitch. I'm fucking dead. Hmm. Not dead. Mm. I might be able to get tower here. How do you like that? I should be able to get tower, and I should be okay, because he doesn't have all. See, I would have been okay if I didn't fucking use my two like a goddamn moron. Okay, guess I'm going this way. 
Alright. Duke the one. You don't scare me, Mr. Krabs. He's one HP. Gonna go clear the wave. He'll be fine because he can teleport away. But I have a minion. Which means this is mine, bitch. See you later. Nice. Very, very nice. All right. What an eventful fight, dude. What an eventful fight. God damn it, I missed the back one. I can't be trusted. I can't be trusted, dude. I suck. Um. The Soul Eater. We're just gonna do the speed buff and then back finish Soul Eater. Uh, Soul Eater is gonna be really big. He has no anti heal. I mean, for obvious reasons, why would he, right? So, Soul Eater is gonna be big. Also, it's 10% more cooldown, so I could officially sell Mage's Blessing and still be capped at, at max cooldown, which is very nice. Very, very nice. Hmm. I mean, I do damage, but it's not enough to, like, scare him away, you know what I mean? I duke the one. Maybe I just ult and do bull demon. I didn't think that he had his TP up, dude. I thought... I mean, I guess I should have known. I just didn't know if he would do that. And there it is. 90% anti yo. He still fought me and beat me in the fight. I need more damage. I mean, I lose Phoenix here, so obviously it doesn't really matter. But I need more damage. Or more tankiness. Either one works, honestly. I'm down to go Void Shield. A little bit of bulk, maybe. It's that level 20 set, man. It's that full build set, no matter how far ahead I was. Doesn't matter at this stage in the game. Once I finish my Soul Eater stacks here, it'll be nice, but... I really don't clear well at all against Fire Minions. If I do, I have to use my 1 to do it, and I don't want to do that. See, I don't know who this player is. So I'm gonna buy some wards because I feel like he might backdoor. I don't know why he has kins, by the way. That's bad. But I've got my eye that's what it is, I suppose. Do a red buff. Upgraded shell would be really big for me. So let's work on that right now. Do 
You probably did write him back by the looks of it. How do you like that? All right. We did get a toxic blade. He's building a lot of attack speed, man. Jump away. Hey, I'd hit him for fifty two, baby. All right. I was okay with using my one there because if he did all in, I don't think he would have won the fight. So I was chilling with that one. And because he just backed, I should be safe to do this should be. If I'm not, then it's on me, man. Alright, Phoenix back up. I have everything. I have everything and he has everything. He doesn't have upgraded shell, though. I need to be more careful using my jump like that. Nice. So basically what I what I did there in order to try to win that fight was my whole game plan was outweigh his three. Like I needed I needed to win the fight, obviously to not lose the game. And the only way in my eyes to win that fight was to completely wait out his three. That'll tank a couple shots. And my minions will get in there. A tough game, dude. Alright, we got his shell and his Aegis as well. Red buff is down. I don't really know what I want right now. I'll go with 1500 pot just in case I want to sell boots. Which I kind of do for... Hmm. I kind of want to get a, uh, a crusher, to be honest. Back speed a little bit increased. How do you like that? But in order to get a crusher, I got to farm like 1500 gold before I sell. Damn. That does not feel good, I'll tell you what. I will tell you what. See if we can get this red buff. Alright, we can. I gotta be able to win a fight, but I think the only way to win the fight is wait for relics up, to be completely honest. If I don't have relics, I don't win the fight. Alright. Nice. So I have full 7 item build. I have red buff. I have red pot. I have everything up. This is all I need in order to win the game. So basically what I have to do to get him to commit to a fight is I have to jump in to act like, oh no, I messed up and he can win the fight. And then 
I have to alt, use my two, make sure that I um, curse stonk at the correct time, make sure that I shell the right amount of damage. It's a lot, but if I can pull it off, we can win the game. That was huge damage, actually. Not anything that I was expecting. Got minions in for the Phoenix. Alright. Dude, he's taking so much damage. His three is down. Right now is the perfect time to fight him. Nice. Nice, his three was down, so it was it was literally just the straight up perfect time to fight. GG, well played. No 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 another GM player and he's on set. Well played man. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did make sure to like, comment, and subscribe, and until next time guys, peace.